Hey guys, it's Lily, and sorry for the really, really long time I'm not making a video. It's been my brother's birthday, I've been extremely sick, um, and I've been doing exams and tests at school. So that's left me confused for way many days. So, today I'm going to be filming a different video for you guys. So I'm really extremely sorry that I've not been making a video in a while. I'm out of breath because I'm just running up the stairs really, really fast to make this video right now. But I'm going to show you my two new hobbies in that time that I've come past. So, yeah, let's get started. First of all, it's weaving. Now, you have a wool and you glue two lollipop sticks together. And you can, if you want a tutorial, just ask down below. You can make, they used to do this in the olden days. And you can make little things like this. This one's used with brown wool, and here's what the back looks like. So I'm going to show you my collection of those. So some of them are untied, but I can easily just tie them back together. So, yeah, tutorials if needed, just ask me. I have this grey one. This one. Some of them are a bit junky because, like, for me, the first ones, take them off, I'll you out. And here are my lollipop sticks. I've done this light pink one. The colours don't look like the actual R on camera, but no. I have this orange one. And this one's untied a lot for some reason. Um, I'm just gonna quickly weave it round again just to suit itself once more time. Because sometimes it comes undone because I don't do it tight enough. And these ones are really hard to tighten off because of it's got two different colours which is really hard to weave off. Just the way it is. So this one's a bit ripped and stuff like that. They have this bumblebee kind of one. I have this lilac purple. It looks blue on camera. I know the colours don't look like this in person on camera. Because I'm not actually filming it in my window because I can't make it night time outside. Um, I've got this, oh wait no, this one's the blue one, this one's the lilac purple. I've got this kind of red toned brown. i got this pink and purple one. i got this neon yellow. This one looks like white, but it's not. It's actually a cream. I promise it's not white. This one's... Yeah, this one's the white one. That's white. They are... They are different colours, I swear. I don't think you can tell on camera, but they are different. I have this like royal red one and I also have a regular red one which looks like pink a bit on camera and I have this like purple one and this neon pink one I have this beige one some of the walls coming undone because I haven't done them up tight enough. And this yellow one. Um, I have this lime green one. And I have this golden one. This royal blue one. It looks really dark. And my first one that I've ever made, which is really, really bad. So I do have another one of these that I've made. So this is attempt number one, this is attempt number two. So I think they look way more better. So this is what they look like when you glue two lollipop sticks together. Look like this. Just like that. 
And yeah, I have at least 30 of them. That's quite a few. Um, and I can't show you my wall because basically I've made all of these that I've made are all of my colours of my wall. So, um, so now I'm going to show you my other hobby, which is clay charms. Now I'm really, really excited to show you my clay because I love doing clay and I'm basically doing it all the time. So let me show you. So first of all, I keep them in two baggies, two bags, because they're um, different. And I've also made another one that of some of his but those were for friends. This one is full of non-food ones. This one's full of food. So we're going to throw the non-food first. So first of all, this is technically not food because it's like technically not food because it's a drink. Um, I just want to say that... Oh, I what I was going to say. It will come back to me. So I got this Fanta. I'm not that good at doing these, by the way. Um, I got this camera. My brother made this one. Don't judge it. It's kind of bad that it's coming in. Um, I have this Minnie Mouse ring. The ring is not clay. The I just made the Minnie Mouse piece. I made this world. I have this little jar of nail polish. This one's a green one. I have also another drink, which is this Coke, Coca Cola. It says Coke on it, and there's the little Coke. I mixed uh, the brown and white together to get a light brown. I have this rainbow panel, red, orange, yellow, green, light, blue, dark, blue, purple, and pink. Neon pink. I have this little poop, inspired by the poop emoji. And my two first homemade, um, homemade. My two first charms that I've ever made were these two. This one was the first one I made, then I made a second attempt at it, which doesn't really look any better, but these are emojis. And backs. Okay, next I have this sh sugar cube. Um, I have this octopus. It's really bad. And a little octopus. Um, the last three in here is this bunny, snow bunny, and this red nail polish bottle, and this pink nail polish bottle. So those are my charms that I've made that are not actually foods. I have made other charms, but I've given those to family members. Um, because some, uh, they, like, I like making charms for my family, because, like, they can put them in their bags or whatever they want to do with them, and stuff, because my mom really likes my charms, so, I make loads for her, and I make loads for everybody else, and my friends at school and stuff, so, that's the food, uh, non-food ones, now we're getting into the food ones. First of all, we have this little uh, chocolate bun. It is not white clay, by the way. Any like food ones that are like a, that are supposed to be used with the bun is used with a cream clay. I have this rainbow sprinkled donut with the white icing, uh, vanilla icing. 
is like one of my favorites. Then I have this toast with a egg yolk on the side. An egg. Um, I have this blue donut. And I have this peas in a pod. I have this banana peel one. This is not used with white clay, by the way. It looks a bit tilted. I don't know why it is a bit tilted. And the peel. The most recent one, I think, is a. I have this orange. This is the first one that I made actually. I just remembered. It's called black clay on the bag, don't worry. It's not mold, it's just black clay. Hello Kitty, again it's really bad because it's the first one I made. Um I have this sugar cookie. By the way, that's not a face. I have this egg yolk emoji. Egg. I have this three layer cake, which is one of my least favorites. One of my favorites is definitely my ice cream cone, which is one of my faves. And it has got Demi on there. So yeah. Next also is one of my favorites is this taco. So it's got beef, like or meat, lettuce, and shredded cheese and the corn shell. I have this hot dog, which a basic hot dog is basically a British version of like a of a taco. This one's got the uh, sausage, uh, the bread bun, and the mustard. I got my lollipop. Any tutorials on how to make these, just comment down below. I got this one, which is a strawberry. Strawberry, I don't want to say it like that. You can tell this one's also got indentings on it. Um, I also have this mini tofu I have got this chocolate chip cookie a mini strawberry ice donut um, I have this strawberry with white Vanilla sprinkles donut. I have this Swiss roll. So I get vanilla sponge Swiss roll. And my hamburger, which is not that good because, like, this is like too big. Not big enough. But it's got tomatoes, lettuce, beef patty, and a bun, which I actually didn't have. Um, this light cream color at the time so I had to use like the yellow for the bun and then same with this one I made this cheeseburger and here's the cheese and the beef patty and then this one is actually got a churn thing on it, on it and it because I wore this one on my bag once the school but I'm not going to put it on my bag again this one's got a little face on it which looks super kind of creepy, like I'm not going to deny it. Um, yeah, this one's got a little thing on there. And it's a journey tell. And my last one that I made, which is food, is this carrot. So if you guys enjoyed this video, if you make sure you have a big thumbs up, like, comment, subscribe, any tutorials or anything how to make it, um, just comment down below. See you guys next time. Bye. Follow me on Instagram. And... Yeah, I'll leave it in the comments down below. Bye, guys.